Hey guys, welcome back to the Empress Show. This is your Wonder Woman Julie. If you're new here, consider yourself a beautiful soul who is very much welcome. We love new souls. And if it's not your first time, Karibu Sana as usual, this is a place where you get well, real stuff raw and candid karibuni sana and thank you so so much for your continued support guys i really really appreciate it. you keep me going guys you keep me going and uh of course um this month we say this month we are doing episodes of um relationships love because it's our love month guys it's our love month it doesn't mean that um these other months <laughs> we don't love each other no but uh may being our love month we respect it so much so guys um as i continue with these episodes today i want to talk about men 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 yeah last time i spoke about women mistakes women make if you haven't watched that video please go click that uh, video and watch till the end <laughs> you know and tell them these are the mistakes eh? this particular one that you've been seeing her do and you tell her you see you see other women know <laughs> so kariboni sana as usual i appreciate your support i appreciate your love guys so today um i want to talk to you men and i want to dedicate this to future husbands current husbands and wannabe husbands <laughs> and um you know sometimes some men go into a relationship without being ready or without being sure let me just say being sure because you rarely find a man settling when he's not um, ready but he can settle when he's not sure so men if you get a wife if you get a girl who is ready to settle with you unangojea nini <laughs> unangojea nini i mean just make that move and one thing for sure i know is that so many um or uh, rather maybe 90 percent of women if not 99 we love being pampered <laughs> yes me being one of them we love being pampered we love being given the attention yeah so every lady will want the processes to be followed what are these processes one of them proposed to her unangojea proposed to her I, the, the other day i saw i saw there's a lady who proposed and uh <laughs> i saw it on tuko uh tuko is it tuko or Mpasha, one of them and uh <laughs> there was a statement saying did she die because it's a it's a lady who proposed to a guy and then they were sarcastically asking uh did she die now that she proposed to a guy but uh hold on hold on to that point hold on to that point but my ladies um please wait for him that is what i would advise because you can propose to a guy he will say yes and maybe he was not ready that is why he had not proposed to you and uh, what i know is that a lady a lady can learn to love in a relationship even if she started uh she went into a relationship without having any you know emotions or feelings for this particular guy but a guy cannot easily love a, a lady if from the beginning he did not like her or he did not love her so ladies uh, please hold on hold on hold on i am of a contrary opinion when it comes to that so let him do it if he's not ready to do it give him an ultimatum <laughs> i know this is not a good advice but i mean you don't waste your time don't waste your time so men if you found someone who you know that uh you'd love her to be your wife don't waste time just go into it take your time though take your time to 
you know learn each other mkosane kukosana it's very very healthy mkosane mpigane you know get to know her weak points get to know her strong points get to know what makes her tick what really irritates her all those kind of things do not waste your time there are other people there are other guys out there who are waiting for that you 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 as a particular guy to waste your time and then they peter with your girl do not blame her do not blame them you wasted your time so guys if you get a woman who is ready to settle with you a woman who is serious a woman who loves you a woman who treats you like the king you are treat her like a queen treat her like a trophy you know treat her like a queen and a trophy that uh, her ways to come to your eye break so guys take take note of that take note of that because especially this era getting a woman who who is ready to settle who is ready to be a good wife who is ready to love you for who you are whether you have money or not whether you you are from a well off family or not able to take her grab her like you know like there is no other <laughs> so just treat her like a trophy because we are trophies we are queens and remember a queen only exists where there is a king so yeah so another point is um guys if your woman needs you emotional support give her if you don't want her to be given outside there give her i don't know what's happening with the shadows and all that but anyway so if your woman needs emotional support give her because she needs it she's not pretending give it to her and i think women are emotional beings so if you see her cry it's because she feels like crying right right there <laughs> listen to her just hug her give her what she wants what i mean is certain <laughs> certain material things i don't know but if she needs that hug give her if she needs that you know that kiss just give her because that is that is what the emotional part of her is demanding at that particular time and if you can treat her uh, you know with material things why not yeah why not don't go outside there start treating others while you can treat your own wife so yeah um guys you have a very big role to play in your relationship for you to get uh that woman who will not make mistakes that we spoke about in our previous video uh but just make sure that you are a king you are a real king to her just just don't treat her the way other friends think you should treat a woman A woman is a very valuable valuable being. You'd not be here if it was not a woman. So we we must respect women. We must respect um what they do. We must respect everything about a woman. Do not love a woman because of her body. Do not love a woman because of her looks. Do not love how a woman because of the way she talks, because of the way she dresses, because of the way she vibes. No, 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 no. that is not love <laughs> that is not love guys that is just do i call it infatuations or something yeah because um you you should love a person for who they are it's about who they are and who they are is inside them what comes out of them is what makes up of them not the outward look not the way they dress and if you like if you like if you like you know if you see a lady out there and you admire the way she looks because of her dressing code go and buy your wife go and buy your girlfriend that dress that kind of a dress because that's what you enjoy looking at if you like a certain perfume um that maybe you've you've come across outside there with maybe a friend of you as a colleague or some you know just someone and it's a lady and you know what it tickles you when you just um around them just because of their perfume go and buy her that perfume and just just make sure that whatever you like out there you come and uh actualize it in you in you in your woman because um this is the woman that you love this is the woman that you truly do love 
it is not lust it is not infatuations so treat her like you know like there's no tomorrow treat her like a trophy because she's easily breakable she's delicate so take note of that there's um usually i i bought i bought this little book for hubby long long time ago it says to my husband with love here to my husband with love and it's it's a little book of quotations um different people wrote different things uh to husbands <clears throat> and it says um uh, today i'll only read one or two it says a successful marriage requires falling in love many times always with the same person so you need to you need to be real with yourselves fight argue not physical fight guys yes uh argue disagree to agree or you know all that and then fall in love over and over like once he or she steps out you all you you know you already feel like you're missing that person if that person travels you feel like ah, 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 ah. any i can't do without this person keep falling with one person because you decided to dedicate your life to that particular person so a successful marriage requires that you fall in love every other time uh, not just once and that's it no 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 and then uh, another quote that i really loved is getting married is one mistake every man should make yeah every man should make that mistake and you will not regret it because it's a positive mistake <laughs> it's a positive mistake so i want to i want to leave it at that but uh future husbands current husbands or guys in a relationship treat your woman like a trophy because she is a trophy treat her like a queen because she is your queen and there is no other person who should treat her like a queen if they do please don't lie to yourself that you're hacking no 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 someone else is so um i want to wind up with um udaku <laughs> so the other day i was uh, going to town and um i happened to take uh these buses um nilienda nilienda gidurai and uh, i took a bus from there <laughs> And then I sat in between two men in between two men who um who are quite big <laughs> and so I was actually struggling to sit so nili kwa mekanika niko kwa hewa and then I joked to them and I looked at them and they was like I'm literally hanging to see their reaction and they were both busy on phone and I was like oh. anyway <laughs> and then the, uh, later like it's like they were trying to load the information and uh later they were like uh, i will try and push kidogo like now they were communicating to each other then i happened to one of the guys looked quite old and who huge hey <sighs> those mubabas and then <laughs> i decided to be a bad girl um Udako udako ipendi eh inatoa umbe ya upendi uvivu <laughs> I decided to not deciding rather I flipped my eyes and so what he was doing okay that's called is dropping um, <laughs> I when I should I be sorry to who though anyway I'm not sorry so I happened to is drop on what he was doing on his phone because I was so curious Mm, I was paying back my curiosity. So <laughs> the moment I flipped my eyes um towards him I saw he was chatting with a kachike a ka lady and uh, I could tell this is a young girl who he is chatting with and um he was cheating Guys please as long as you're married as long as you're committed to someone please don't cheat if you want to cheat go sit down with your girl go sit down with your wife agree on things that you know what 
I am seeing this other lady and uh, I want, I don't know whether you're comfortable with it. I, I just, just do something. Don't make her look like a fool eh? at home trying to, you know, talk about how good of a husband you are, yet you're cheating out there. So this guy was actually cheating with this girl and um, this girl was like, uh, do you have kids? <laughs> And me, I'm looking at this guy and I'll be like, you actually have grandchildren. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. You actually have grandchildren. So I was like, she shouldn't be asking about kids. She should be asking about, do you have grandchildren? Because this guy looked quite old and it was disturbing to me. It was disturbing to me because... I was just thinking the kids, I was just thinking about the kids, the wife, and I'm sure the kids might be even older than I am. And he is busy. He's busy cheating with kids. It's so unfortunate, guys. Do not disrespect yourself to that level. No. We say K is constant. If you know, you know. So... Um, if you feel like you you don't like the way you do it, try and <laughs> do research. Do research on ways that would uh, entice you with your you know with your person, not with anybody else. With your person, ensure that whatever you want outside there, you come and actualize it in your house. Come and actualize it with the person that you love. Do not do not go. Yani. Yeah, if you know, you know. Kienda, ikienda gidu, gidurai, inainua tu. Ikienda ruiru, ina, ikienda tao, ina. You know, it's only dogs who do that. So do not make yourself a dog. No, you're more than that. Yeah, and that is why you have a beautiful person looking out for you. Um, you know, taking good care of you. And you should appreciate, you should appreciate. So dear husbands, please, please, please appreciate the person that you are with. Appreciate what you have. If you don't like it, go and mold it, remold it, rebrand it. Yeah? To make it what you like. So guys, if you're not married, that is one mistake you should make. If you are in a relationship, do not waste your time if it is the right person. So um, I don't have much to say, but take notes. And um, <coughs> and if, if you have anything to add on these, please down on the comment section, let us know what do you think your dear future husband or your current husband should be doing to make you feel special. So guys don't cheat guys treat her like a queen like the queen she is treat her like a trophy like the trophy she is because we are pamper her do everything that you love uh to do or you, you'd love uh her to do to you she cannot bring out love if she's not loved she cannot bring out respect if she's not respected she cannot you know, she cannot give what she doesn't have. You only give what you have. So there you go, guys. Uh, let me know what you think about this discussion down on the comment section. Let me know um, what <laughs> what tickled you in this particular uh, episode. And we shall meet in the next video. As usual, I love you so much and I appreciate your time. Mwah.